Now let's demonstrate the replacement of the SUP20S protective lens. Unscrew the hand screw, pull out the protective lens drawer, cover with masking tape to keep ash out. Rotate and remove the compression ring. Replace protective lens. After the replacement, insert the protective lens drawer into the lens compartment. Now, the protective lens has been replaced. Now, let's demonstrate the replacement of the SUP20S collimator lens. Step 1. Remove the side cover. Release the collimator lens temperature resistor. Step 2. Remove the switch fiction plate. Remove the insulation gasket. Step 3. Loosen the three screws of the QBH lock. Pull out the QBH lock. Step 4. Take the lower limited seat. Loosen the four screws at the bottom. Take the lower limited seat. Cover with mask and tape. To keep ash out, remove the locking ring. Take out the collimator lens. Replace the collimator lens. After the replacement, collimator lens on the flat side is facing up. Install the locking ring. Be careful to keep it horizontal to prevent ash. Be careful not to drop the old ring. Align the pin and install the limited seat. Also be careful to keep it horizontal. Install the screw. Install the QBH lock. This mark at the bottom. Align it with the upper set screw. Keep them in a straight line. Tighten the screws. Install the insulation gasket. Install the switch fixing plate. Is the collimator lens temperature resistor. Is the side cover. The collimator lens has been replaced.